you are the God that answers by fire. First King chapter 18, 24. Cause your glorious voice to be heard. Show lightning down your arm with flame of devouring fire with scattering tempests and hailstones. Isaiah chapter 30, verse 30. Let your fire protect me and cover me. Exodus 14, 24. Mm. Angel number 523 says, end toxicity. Stop a cycle. There's a present situation that reflects a much larger pattern. Your guides want you to see it. Where in your life today can you stop a cycle of toxicity? Reflect on what it is that needs to end and write down a boundary you can put in place to do so. What I was hearing was training day is over. Training day is over. Releasing these toxic relationships is for their own good. Did you hear me? Listen to it again if you need to understand it. Releasing these toxic relationships are for their inner good. It's a message within all messages that we take that resonates in our personal realm of being. You hear me? When it comes to a spotlight being on you, it is a spotlight on you. It's the light from the most high, and it's folk who want to dim that light, right? It's how you shine. And shit, you could have just came on abruptly. You know what I'm saying? A light bulb just came on abruptly. A light just flickered quick, fast, and in a hurry to put you on your toes so you can be ten toes down with your spiritual team. So... When it comes to steak and eggs and and biscuits and rice and gravy and all of that, we're going to put a stop to those type of chemical additives is what I heard. That's what your spiritual team has been guarding you to do. Guarding, huh? They're trying to guard you from... A particular group of people. They're carnivores, you know. But it's how these relationships are designed. They're designed to keep you under a psychic attack. You're, and these psychic attacks are you going against your intuition. You um, stand in hermit mode um, longer than anticipated, you know, because there's a season, a reason in a got darn lifetime. What's up, y'all? Y'all know I'm coming with the actual factuals. I'm here to get you hip to what you hip to or hip you on to what may be hidden. Go on and hit that like button if you've been rocking with me out the gate. And if you just subscribe or you just falling through, you 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 press play for a reason. You hear me? And these reasons are so much so known to you. But, you know, it's a lot about your life. That's unknown to folk who swear that they can map out your progress. They swear that they can envision something new in your life and that your light is a spirit that they can expand with, right? What I'm seeing is that you need to trust in the unknown. Mm-hmm. When it comes to that light, that light can be a fire far away. But that fire, I'm I'm hearing, is fueling a lot. It's fueling your passion, for one. It's some sort of engagement that you are deeply connected to and you don't even know. It's the process of elimination right now is what the G's are saying. The process of elimination, so... 
that they can perfect a situation um, that you are deeply rooted in, that you, I'm hearing, are going to be co-creating. You hear me? Let's see what the good tarot got to say real quick. We got the hangman. Hmm. We got the hangman. 12. So, when it comes to that number 12, that makes me think of the police, 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 police. Training day over. It's nothing like your freedom. You hear me? That's what I'm hearing. It's nothing like your freedom. And somebody wants you to surrender your freedom. Somebody wants you to wait until all of their elements are in place, you know. So listen, you know, you've been told to let go of this person, this um, particular attachment that you have to um, a thought or... A uh, old beef is what I'm hearing, but what is beef, right? Somebody is like the last engine that could is what I'm hearing. The last engine that could on them train tracks, on those train tracks. And I'm seeing it's, it's a timetable when it comes to this train going by, right? The hangman is also here to remind you of what's been holding you up. What's holding up that train? What's in place to make somebody fall to their knees? Trip themselves up is what I'm hearing. It's a it's a goddamn thought. Yeah, it's a thought. You know what? This thought took some some planning. You hear me? It took some planning on on your end. And when it comes to your spiritual team, they, they help you to clear out some toxicity in your world. You know, had you to become very passionate about a guiding light. Looking at these dangerous minds for who and what they are. The universe is already aligned you with itself and some 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 bomb ass relationships and spiritual connections to bring you what it is that you need and to keep you on the right path what's the second card mm. to a water hmm <laughs> with this hangman and this to a water it's so your, your spiritual team, I'm hearing, they've been policing somebody, okay? They've been policing somebody. Um, what's happening right now, I'm hearing, when it comes to this tour of water, has a lot to do with passionate efforts to remain free. Right? This can be, you know... Staying on the legal side of money. This could be um, remaining single. Um, this can be, you know, trying to sever ties with some with some relationships of the romantic capacity that you felt as though you needed to bend corners and bend yourself. Actually, and these, you know, I'm looking at, you know, somebody who's fly by night, and I'm hearing somebody who's, you know laid back in the day and day and night it's a heart connection it is it's a heart connection and this this connection has been expressed to both of y'all you know on levels 